Hey guys, what's up? It's Jess. All right, this video is gonna be a little bit different. Um, I'm going to try vlog style videos. I'm really enjoying watching those kind of videos right now. And I think that doing vlog of either what I'm doing or what the kids are doing, the family's doing, I don't know. Uh, I don't have a clear vision for this channel right now, I think. Um, so I'm trying to figure that out. And I figure since I enjoy watching those kind of videos, maybe I'll try making them and seeing how that works for my schedule and the family and whatever my hair I just obviously I just got out of the shower my hair is super crazy but here's what we got going on today we've got husband is out here let me show you that husband is out here uh working in the backyard he's doing that and let's see what the kids are doing hey guys what are you guys doing cleaning out your car you're cleaning out my car and what do you clean up why are you cleaning out my car because we're going on a trip. We're going on a trip? Where are we going to go? Prescott. Uh-huh. Why? Yeah. Because um, we were... I was doing something for Yeah, Kiki. Okay, Ruger. Oh, Ruger, I'm going to keep that. Just leave it there. Um, I was doing something for school, and I... um, We were all supposed to learn about oh. a city, and I chose Prescott. Okay. You're sitting on your sister's head. I chose Prescott because I have an aunt that lives there. Yeah, so we're going to go to Prescott and the kids are going to clean out the car. So we have a clean car for our trip, right? The, the car, they're going to go clean out the car. And uh, all I had to do was say, hey, go get a bag. Let's get ready to clean out the car. And they just started doing it without me. Uh, so I think that means I can do my declutter project. So what I've got going on is uh, we have a little hallway with some shelves and that's where all of the craft supplies go. So we need to, it's very hard for them to be able to grab what they want to do for crafting. Like I have to go help them because it's so unorganized and chaotic. Um, so I need to get in there and I need to do some organizing and decluttering. Uh, so that if they want to do an art project, all they have to do is go and grab the bin and, and do what they want to do, whether it's painting or just grabbing random materials and creating stuff. So that, I think, is what I'm going to work on right now. Friday. What are you guys doing? Uh, we're looking at paints to see which ones are dried out and which ones are not. Oh, okay. And we found lots of glitter. So see you guys this is what I'm talking about. Like this is a craft bin that we had in that closet and it's just chaotic. And this is another one. And it's just like not organized. There's a whole bunch of just stuff everywhere for us to make crafts with. Yeah, we can call Jima and say thank you later. Anyway, we just need to be able to have some order in our craft corner so that they can craft when they want to. Today is day two of our um, declutter and cleaning. Look at those. How did those get out there? Put those in, put those where they go. Okay, day two of our declutter cleaning thing. Um, I filmed another video today. This look, um, I don't know, th that video will probably go up first. Um, all right, let me show you what we've done. So yesterday, I had the kids organizing some of the art stuff because I needed to get the art area decluttered. Um, I ended up making a list of everything that I want to get done over the next week while I'm off work. And um, I ended up prioritizing some things over 
the closet. I didn't record it because uh, yesterday was chaotic, but here's what I've got. Okay, um, you know, this may not look beautiful compared to your pantry, but for me, this looks wonderful. I wish I had a before picture. And of course, now that I'm showing this, I'm like, yeah, this is actually not very nice. Whatever, it's a pantry. Don't judge. No judging, this is judgment free zone. All right, my pantry looks better than it did before. I also did under the stairs yesterday. Uh, under the stairs storage. Again, I didn't take any before pictures or video, but this is it now. I can actually walk in here now. Before there was a massage table that was over here on this wall. So I, it, was, it was really hard to get in here and walk around. But anyway, now it'll be a lot easier to walk around. So, or craft hall. So up here, I've got my old, old sewing machine, a bin full of bow making stuff. Actually, all this stuff up here is for bow making. More bow making jar, just random stuff. I keep everything. Bows, art projects. So the kids organized this. This used to be full of paint and miscellaneous things. Now it's got all of their Play-Doh and whatnot, their sand. Play-Doh. They went through and made sure that everything is still fresh. A couple projects. This is just a bin of random, random stuff. All of our perler beads in this bin so they can just like easily grab it and use it. Painting stuff. We've got our brushes and cups, towels, paper, paint here. Play-Doh tools and here is just um, some projects. So this is a robotics book. Um, we can make a turkey guy, just a bunch of projects. Uh, random stuff, popsicle sticks, markers, uh, glitter and rhinestones. random art project stuff. We just get crafty. We just, all right, glue, adhesive, mod podge, hot glue, beads and buttons, twine, pipe cleaners, googly eyes, pipe cleaners, googly eyes, and so again, I did a bad job. I should have filmed of it before, but I didn't. I'll get used to this vlogging thing eventually. Uh, closet is totally clean now. Look at all that space. That used to be covered with the kids' schoolwork. And this is stuff like we got travel toys in here. We're taking a trip tomorrow, so that's not full anymore. Outdoor blankets for a park and backpacks and stuff. Jacket. I always keep extra presents. I, these bins, this is Ruger's memory stuff, and this is uh, Matilda's. And there's school stuff in there, there's birthday stuff and cards and everything. So it all just piles. So now they can just put in, put it in this box, put a lid on it, and then once it gets full, I can sort it. Okay. So one thing I did find um, when I was cleaning the closet was my Letterman jacket. Look at this, you guys. All right. That's a heavyweight jacket. It's very, very heavy, but look. It's got my name on it. It's got my graduating year, my letter. I lettered in dance two years and cheer one year. How do I look? You look good in it. Oh, you just gotta you. stop moving. Oh, sorry. <laughs> stop moving. Ew! I just took a, I just took a few chunks off of his arm. Dad, did, did you eat it? Where's that going? I'm scared. It won't hurt you. What are you scared of? It has this weird taste to it. The other arm fell off. All right, show me what you got. What do you have? Mm, a bug. 
A bug? What kind of bug is it? A uh, scorpion. Scorpion? All right, are you gonna eat it? No. I'm about to eat a scorpion arm. All right, she, Kiki's gonna do it. Sugar, do it with me, it'll be okay. okay. Get closer. Put it, in mouth. it won't hurt. One, two, three. I can feel it. Ew. But it's not that bad, is it? No. I can't taste it, but I can feel it. Yeah. Eating it? Yeah. Is it good? Yummy! You like it? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Let me see. Hey guys, how's it going? So, uh, I really should have done this a while ago, like when we first got here, because then you would have seen the room before we got in here and got comfy. Um, all right, we are staying at uh, Vindham Hotel, or Hotel, sorry, Hotel Vindham, according to my tour guide here. And um, we're, it's so adorable, it is so cute. We are staying in Abby's room, which is supposedly the haunted room. And it's just really cute, so quaint. Let me show you. This is the little closet. It's a very big, big closet. We got an ironing board and got our stuff. Got like a shoe rack there and just closet. <laughs> Here's the AC. Um, cute little and cheesy. All right, so cute. This I thought was adorable. There's like a little doorbell here, and then um, you get your old fashioned lock there, and then there's this thing, which I thought was adorable. I think what you did is that you like hit this up, and then it would, without that molding right there, it would hit the bell. Um, this is so cute. Got a little thing on the wall. There's a doorbell. Yeah. Cute chair, really like this chair. Our stuff's all over. Matilda's gonna sleep here. So this is a king and um, like we're in a little tiny hotel. Like this place used to house minors. So it's super, super small. Um, hang on, we knew that it was gonna be tiny. We knew that the kids were gonna be, one would be on the floor and then the other would be in bed with us. Um, but it's so cute. It's so adorable. Okay, Matilda wants to show you the bathroom. There's like cats all over. This is a barn door. See, there's the thing. Okay, go ahead and show them the bathroom. No, show. I'll show. So, here. So, there's this teensy toilet and there is a very weird obnoxious tool above the toilet. I've got my Christmas jammies. We both got Christmas jammies on. Like, we're, we heard it gets cold here. Is that a bottle opener in our bathroom? Hey guys, editing Jess here. So I'm editing this vlog and I realized that I didn't really have a plan for how it would flow. Like I think we did a pretty good job like flowing through the organization and then all of a sudden it jumps to Prescott because that's really all I had footage for. I, I really am enjoying editing the vlog. I'm enjoying um, making the vlog. So I may try more vlogs. Anyway, so sorry that it was kind of choppy and that this is a really weird way to close out the video, but I also didn't plan a closing for it because I'm new to vlogging. <laughs> anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to like and subscribe and comment. Tell me what you want to see because I don't know. Bye.